हेलो एवरीवन टुडे आई एम मेकिंग काठियावाड़ी स्टाइल रिंगणा नो ओड़ो इट इज अ फेमस काठियावाड़ी डिश इट्स आल्सो नोन एज बैंगन भरता एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू टू डिफरेंट मेथड्स ऑफ मेकिंग इट लाइक फ्राइड वर्जन एंड नॉन फ्राइड वर्जन दे बोथ ऑफ देम टेस्ट अमेजिंग सो प्लीज डू ट्राई इट नाउ इट इज ऑलवेज इंपॉर्टेंट व्हिच एग प्लांट्स यू सिलेक्ट फॉर दिस आई एम यूजिंग दिस Uh, Chinese eggplants, which are available in most Indian grocery stores, these are nice and soft. If you are living in India, you will have special eggplants for bartha, so it's not a problem. But outside uh, uh, India, uh, there are like big jumbo eggplants available in most grocery stores. I don't recommend those because it's sometimes hard and chewy. But if you get baby version of those and really good quality, you can use that, them as well. Uh, so let's start. Turn the heat on higher side and roast the eggplants. This will take around seven to eight minutes. And every two three minutes we have to change it. Just turn it around and let it roast. Now change it again and check on all the sides. It's okay if it uh, cuts open. And for the front portion, probably you have to roast separately. This uh, uh, recipe is all about smoky flavor. So if you have open fire barbecue, go ahead and roast the eggplants on the barbecue. It gives the best flavor. But oven is the last option you want to try because it doesn't give smoky flavor. And otherwise this is the best method you can roast. So our eggplants are done evenly. And take it on a plate here. Let it cool down for 15 minutes. Now gently remove the skin. So I have roasted total 5 eggplants here. It shrinks a lot in the size. So we need more. And uh, please do not wash it. Otherwise the flavor gets uh, reduced. Now we will cut it like this. All the eggplants. Please do not uh, mix it. Like put it in a bowl and mix it. Otherwise it gets mushy and sticky. We want very nice small chunks separated chunks so our eggplants are ready and we are going to uh, make a non-fried version first so I'll take some portion here we'll keep the rest for the fried version this method of making uh, bartha involves all the raw ingredients only so we have chopped tomatoes onion cilantro and minced garlic very finely chopped some jeera powder, uh, red chilli powder, hing, salt here and he, this is raw peanut oil or you can use any oil and this is very important it gives really good flavor and we will mix this with the roasted eggplant like everything together without cooking let's put the peanut oil first in it and then garlic tomatoes, onion, cilantro and all the masalas now we'll mix it all together nicely believe me friends this tastes so amazing and smells so amazing if you try this once i'm sure you will love it and you will always make it along with the fried version and this is very good for diabetic patients heart patients and weight watchers as well so please do try it i definitely recommend this version now we will go ahead and make a bangan bartha uh, according to the second method this is oil uh, around three tablespoon oil it's already hot add uh, cumin seeds Let it fry. 
this is three uh, whole red chilies it's very important for this flavor and as a fatida let it heat and now we will add onions for this recipe you have to use more oil otherwise if it is less oil it is not kathiawadi recipe originally probably three times more oil used into this our onions are done now soft and translucent we'll add tomatoes the quantity of tomatoes is more than onions let it cook i have a uh, finely chopped garlic in my uh, mortar and then we will crush it along with the red chili powder we'll crush it properly and then we'll use this in the recipe let the onion and tomatoes cook onion and tomatoes are ready it's cooked properly and by the time i crushed my garlic chutney as well this is very flavorful and it gives really good taste to this recipe so now we will add this garlic and red chili powder crushed so the garlic chutney is also cooked now and it is smelling so nice now we will add rest of the masalas turmeric powder and salt you can add jeera powder if you want but i don't like that so i'm not adding it and now we will add our roasted eggplants it nice it is for 2 to 3 minutes as you can see it's really nice red color that's what we want for bengal bharta okay it has been cooking for 3 to 4 minutes now and it's really nicely done now we we'll like cilantro lots of cilantro and yeah if you can add uh, spring onion and spring garlic at this point it's really uh, better so the dish is ready and now we'll take it in a bowl so friends i am going to serve this uh, delicious odo with uh, bajina rotla and uh, lasanni chutney and chaas I have separate video for garlic chutney and bajji dotla on my channel so please check it out please like and share my recipe and thank you for watching